Tonight, a controversy from the White House. Some people are upset over a couple of comments Jared Kushner made on White House grounds. So some uh, people took his words to mean that many black people complain and they don't try to be successful. Brianna Whitney has reaction from the local black community tonight. Brianna, what do they have to say? Yeah, Heather, they say these comments are disheartening and disappointing. Take a listen to what Jared Kushner said today on air. And again, one thing we've seen in a lot of the, 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 the black community, which is mostly Democrat, is that uh, President Trump's policies are the policies that can help people break out of the problems that they're complaining about. But he can't want them to be successful more than they want to be successful. And I spoke to a Phoenix constitutional law attorney who is not only black, but went to NYU law school with Jared Kushner and has known him for over a decade. He says it bothers him that Kushner felt comfortable enough to casually say those words, calling the comments bigoted. To assume that everybody else of a different color or, or ethnicity um, just doesn't want to work hard, uh, to me says he doesn't know many people in that ethnicity. Um, and frankly, he doesn't know his history um, of, of this nation. Um, so he just seems really out of touch. The East Valley NAACP issuing us this statement that reads, Jared Kushner's comment clearly demonstrates his disconnection from the African-American community. There are a plethora of successful people in the black community, and it's disheartening to hear him refer to our cries for justice as complaining. I wonder how he feels about Martin Luther King Jr. or Malcolm X. Now, in an effort to get a response from the Republican side, I've been reaching out all day to the Trump campaign, the Republican National Committee, and the AZGOP for interviews or a statement in regards to Kushner's comments, but have not gotten a response back from any of them. Reporting live tonight, Brianna Whitney for Arizona's Family.